Welcome back, guys, to Super Auto Pets with me, Massive Dynamic. We're back into the weekly. It is Monday morning, and I have not looked. Haven't played the weekly yet, so I don't know what we have available. I will take a moth, but I'm going to pass on the grasshoppers. A fish is always a friend. Um, you know, I don't mind the bluebird, but I'm going to take the marmoset for the stats for this first round. We got the peach again, it looks like. Let's be the huge puppies. Like, uh huge puppy like um, I don't know like maybe a, a small horse I don't know a huge puppy the Great Dane I guess would be too simple um, let's see we got the horse speaking of horses and the silk moth uh, friend ahead hurt give it one health works two times per turn interesting um, we'll try that I don't think I've ever tried the silk moth before we'll give it a test uh, the ant is always a friend we'll take an ant and I guess since I don't like either of those and no, no matches there, we'll take a peach. And I think a peach goes good with what well, looks like a silk moth could use a little bit of help. Let's do that. Gives us a 3-3 three, three pet. So, um, yeah, that's not too bad with that combination. We should be, we should be able to stand up against a few teams out there. Um, let's see if two ants is going to be a problem. Probably. Maybe. Mostly. No, we draw. Okay, we'll take a draw. I'd rather have a couple of wins under my belt at this point, but we'll take a draw. Uh, I guess we'll take a silk moth. I don't know. Um, yak. One damage to itself and plus one attack. And turn. One damage to itself and gains one attack. Interesting. Um, hmm. Oh, wait. With a silk moth. Friend ahead hurt. Give it one health. Oh. Well, I wonder if that seems like a combination, right? Uh, let's, uh, get rid of the marmoset. That gives us a free roll. We'll take the yak. That sounds like it might work together. We'll roll. Um, let's see. None of those. And another fish we'll take because we want one more fish. We'll give us the level up bonus on the fish which we like and I guess we go with that let's see how this works with the yak one two oh yeah it does work okay um, so yeah that's that's a good combination we can keep those two together we have a little bit of self scaling going on early it's not bad what's the dodo doing for them I don't know but we got a win okay so we have to keep these guys together um, the lemur Let's see, lemur gives, uh, what's the toy the lemur gives? It's, um, oh yeah, the garlic. Uh, you know what? I think we'll take a lemur. It's the same as the moth. So we get the same stats, except we get the garlic press as a bonus. And, okay, two stoats, nothing. A meat bone. I'll, th I'll think about a meat bone for a minute. If uh, we don't get anything good, we don't. So let's do a meat bone. Let's do the meat bone on the yak. Why not? Let's see. So the yak goes down to five, up to six, and then back up to six. Okay, so it's stabilized anyway, as long as the moth is with it. Interesting combination there. Um, let's see here. We've got a spawn pet in the back, which means that we get the win. That's two wins. We'll take it. All right, and then another yak, that's great. Finally a level up. Uh, let's see, the Gariel. Now that's a, that's a toy I can get behind. Um, let's see, but I think, I think in this case, I'm gonna take you um, and then sell you. For the chocolate, which I'm going to put on you. Okay, that was a good hit. And then we're going to take the Lynx, which worked out pretty good. Okay, we'll take this combination of pets right here, and we'll go with that. Let's give us a little bit. That's a, we're up to a 9-7. I mean, we're not, we're not flying by any means, but at least we are slowly building something. With the, with the yak. We just need... Okay, well that, that was a good team right there. 
cannot argue that. All right, we'll take, do we go level? What's this yak continue to do in higher levels? Uh, okay, this attack continues to grow. So we need some health on you somehow. Oh, a porcupine is definitely somebody that we like. We can take a porcupine. Also, I found out that if you put the elephant in front of the porcupine, the, the porcupine should shoot back at the elephant. Um, not sure if that's an intended consequence, but I believe it works that way. Um, let's see. So we need... We need something different here. I don't know what. So far, nothing is really striking me. Uh, I'll hold on to another peach. The beta fish... I haven't seen a pill yet, but I haven't really looked. Uh, beta fish is something to consider. And none of these really look good. Let's go here. Um, then I guess we'll put you in the front. And we'll back you up with that. Let's go that way for now. And wait a minute. Oh, I forgot about the moth. Oh, the moth has to go behind. Okay. All right. Well, that's okay. Um, we'll fix that. Oh, uh, we got a draw. All right. So the moth has to advance to there. Another yak. We'll take it. Um, nothing here. Okay, another yak. Let's go level three yak. Um, let's see. Oh, the stingray. A level five toy. That might be something that we think about. Let's take you. That means we'll pull on to it. Wait a minute. Take the flashlight, I think. We'll freeze you. And we'll roll. Let's see, buffalo, three friends sold. No, no, no. Okay, none of those. All right, so yeah, we need... Oh, wait, you're good. We'll put you on the porcupine. We need... I mean, we're not doing... We're not doing really great here. We need we need to make some improvements. I just don't know what we're doing yet because I haven't looked at the shop. I don't know what's out there. I haven't seen any scaling pets yet other than this moth and yak combo. Uh, we'll take that. We need a little bit of that. We need... You know what? I'm going to put that on you. A little more health wouldn't hurt. And we'll give that to you. And Oh, there's there was a sea lion. That was the first scaling pet that I've seen. And, yeah, this is not looking great. But we're... We're going to go with the one... The one we brought to the dance. We're going to dance with the girl we brought to the dance. That's what we're going to do. Uh, let's see. We've got... What is that? What did I see there? That's good. That's good. Okay, this is good. Now, what do you do now? Oh, wait a minute. Uh, plus two health. Okay, that's good. I like it. Um, now, let's see. We can get rid of you. I really like the cobra. Cockatoo, clear faint pets. Two, one. I don't have faint pets. Um, the Cobra, friend ahead, attacks, deal 20% damage. I like that. Let's do that. Right there. It makes more sense to go behind the Yak, but I think... I think we leave it right there for now. Let's roll. Nothing there. And, okay, another... Oh, wait, we can take that. We'll take that. Okay, we have Deer. We have Armadillo. We have the Bird of Paradise. White tiger, giving their uh, plus three and spring. Okay, we'll go with that like that. Come on, moth. We need to build that yak up a little bit more. Let's see who's out there. Okay, so we should win this one, I think. What's the orca going to do? Oh, that's, uh, okay, that's what I saw, the falcon. That's what I saw last round. I've never been able to make a falcon work. Um, let's see, what do we have here? Stew. I think I've ever seen stew before. Um, I... I might... I might think about a stew, I don't know. Um... Do we go level 3 silk moth? Why not, I guess? A lion, start a battle. If this is your highest tier pet, gain 50% attack and health. 
highest tier pet, and you are level five. So we have two, one, three, six, and four. So if we were to get rid of the cobra, we could have a self-scaling lion. That would be a nine, a nine-nine lion versus. Let's hold on to that. We'll chew on that for a minute. Um, let's do the stew, I guess, right here, and we'll think about, we'll see what the cobra does this time, <clears throat> and we'll think about either the lion or the lynx. I like the sniping, though, that we have going on right now. Let's see, we've got 24 on that one. Okay, we can pass that. Okay, this, okay, cannot deny the sniping there. I think we keep the sniping as is. <clears throat> okay, so never mind you. Never mind you. Let's see, llama. <clears throat> We're not going to do llama. Mushroom. No, I would like to have a better scaler, but I don't really see anything. I think a mushroom on a on a cobra makes a bit of sense. Um, there's a snake. Uh, ooh. I mean, does that count? Friend ahead attacks deal 20. Does that count as an attack? If I put a snake behind a cobra, does that count? Let's find out. Let's experiment. Why not? It's the first day, first run of the weekly. We can experiment if we want to. Oh, I should have done. I should have bought the oyster. I messed up there. I got too excited with the uh, what, what I was looking at there. All right, we're going. We're definitely doing this. Roll. More stew. We've got the orca. Orca. That's a random, a random spawner. Um, all right, so the porcupine's got to go. Let's look for a replacement for the porcupine next. Oh, you know what? A taper. I think a taper sounds like a good idea for a porcupine replacement item. <clears throat> also, I'd, I'd really like to get some more, some more stats on the moth. Um, fairly soon. Come on now, we got this. No, we, we a lot of a lot of buses there. We win, we win, we win. That's six. Okay, I like the way that that shook out. Okay, so you go away. Uh, we're gonna bring you in. So you should spawn a you should spawn a snake at that point. I think. Let's see. Oh, there was a um, poodle. I saw a poodle, and also I should have I should have fought harder before I took the the uh, taper. All right, pancakes. Uh, give one pet pancake to friends two two before they start a battle. Okay. Yeah, that's not bad. Let's do that to the snake. Okay, we're up to 23 health now. Are we are we slowly building? We are, I guess we're slowly building health. We need more health on you. Wait a minute. You got this. Go down, poodle. No, no. Oh, okay, we got a big old llama there. Okay. Uh, vulture, two friends faint, deal four damage. No. Okay, we're sleeping. We're taking that. Oh, you know what? The pineapple on the snake makes a lot of sense. Right? <clears throat> okay, so let's try again. 22, 24. Okay, so yeah, we are slowly, slowly gaining health, but we need more scaling. And we only have the one. You're gonna shoot. And you're gonna. There we go. We got it. That's seven. Um, all right. Chocolate's good. Chocolate on the moth, I think, makes sense. Now you're doing. Oh, that's a new one. Uh, friend head hurt. Give it three health. Three health. Okay, that's better. So you're still only taking one damage. So now you're gonna gain a little bit more. That's better. Catfish, I saw there. Hold on. Uh, taper leveling is more important, I think. Yep. Another taper is good too. Hold on. We got a level two pet friendly. Okay. So if it summons another snake, that's great. And so far, that's what it's doing. As long as it doesn't get sniped. Okay. And we need. Okay. This is. We just we destroy him. Destroy him. Fight our way through here, and we win. Okay, that's eight. 
Uh, that's all right. We'll take it. So then this goes here. This goes here. You know what? A chili pepper. Yes. Let's do chili pepper on the yak instead of the uh, meat bone. And another one of you. Also, what's the owl do? Start turning summon one. Level one mouse. Interesting. Ah, I see a combo with the owl and the llama would be interesting. Um, that that is a that, and also the mushroom on the um, taper sounds like a good idea. I like the owl llama combo. There's there's an owl. But we, we're, we're, are you gonna hold on? Stonefish, go down, stonefish. We we draw. We draw with eight eight trophies. Um, okay, so we're doing this. We're doing this. We're gonna roll. We are uh we are taking let's take that. Okay, the yak is gonna be maxed out on damage, but that's okay. We need to max his health out. Uh, that's, that's okay. And plus with the, um, chili pepper. We need more health, though. And what do we have for health food? Whoa, 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 whoa. What happened there? Is that the stonefish? Holy cow. Uh, I have to see that again, please. Is that a stonefish? It was a stonefish. You have 12 damage for one... One random enemy. Why did it... Okay, maybe I need to slow down that... That replay, because that was amazing. And have I even seen a stonefish in my shops? I don't believe I have. Let's take a level three there. Let's take a level two there. Let's grab you. If I have seen a stonefish... It might be time to grab one of those guys. Maybe replace the taper with a stonefish? Also, the, the silk moth, I mean, is doing its thing as a scaler, but maybe a better scaler would be a good thing to do. I think we lose this. That's a lot of firepower there. A lot of health. A lot of weight. Hold on. Keep sniping. Keep sniping. We sniped our way to the victory. That's nine. We'll take nine. That was good snipes. Okay, so we need health. Um, we're going to hold on to the chocolate for a minute. We're going to take the health. Okay, that was a good hit. Okay, now we take the chocolate. I guess the makes sense to go on the cobra. Uh, we need a scaler. Really bad. Uh, maybe we can snipe our way to one more victory in this late game situation if somebody's not doing real great like us. We might be able to get through this. Should we beat them then? Give me a oh, he gave me a moth. Oh, I needed the I needed the good sniping. Um, spawns there. Okay, there's a poodle, but it's way too late to take the poodle at this point. I think we've made our bed. I think we have to sleep in it. Let's take that. Um, let's pass on all that. Pass on all that. Pass on all that. Uh, peach. Yep, I think we go with the yak power. We need a good spawn from our um, taper. If we can spawn more, another taper or another snake. Okay, I think we have a chance here. Wait, do we? Wait. Depends on our spawn. We've got a snake and a taper. That's good. We's, we're gonna get this. We got this. We got this. Okay, there's ten. All right, there's ten. We kind of uh, beat our way there with the snake operation. Um, I like this combination of the yak and moth, although the, ma the moth is too weak and we need uh, more scaling to help out. Um, the taper kind of saved the day. I think the taper might be our MVP for today. But uh, thanks, guys, for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.